guys, it's Rachel. Welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, welcome. Today's video, we are going to be going over my Sephora wish list because we are in the middle of the fall 2021 Sephora sale. Now, if you don't know what the Sephora sale is, I think it's twice a year they do an event where first Rouge gets to go, and I'll put the dates on the screen somewhere to show you who goes when, but Rouge goes first and they get 20% off, VIB goes second and they get 15% off, and then Beauty Insiders go and I think they get 10% off. So it's a really big deal because Sephora doesn't have a lot of sales, and so... <laughs> everybody usually gets something during the sale and I definitely have a wish list prepared. <laughs> now I am only VIB so I can only participate in the like second round of dates. I think it starts today the day I'm uploading it for VIB so hopefully stuff isn't sold out but let's go over my loves list and the things that I am eyeing. I'm probably not gonna get all of them because you know I am not made of money, but like if I could, these are the things I would get. I'll probably only get like two or three of them though. So I was inspired to do this by my friend Bridget Snyder. I will have her video linked down below, but she basically went through, did a screen recording of her whole loves list and shows you everything that she was wanting and talked about her wish list for the sale and anything I'm talking about I will definitely have linked down below for you to check out if you are interested but I'm gonna scoot over we're screen recording so three two one here we go so the first thing on my list is the Sephora collection glitter cooling facial globes like they are so cute and they look really tiny which I like because I don't have a big face and most cooling globes look really huge like too huge so I I don't know they're $25 though I mean it is 30% off Sephora collection during the sale so I would get 30% off but I'm unsure about these because I do have like rollers and gua sha's and tools so I don't necessarily need it. These would just be nice to have. And then the next thing on my list is the Rare Beauty Blush Trio. This has three shades and I don't think I have any of the shades because I only have one shade and it's Happy. This one has Bliss, Hope, and Peace and they all look really like cute and wearable neutral pink colors so I'm really interested in this because I really do like the one I have um and it's $25 for those three the next item is the Sephora and House of Lashes Naughty and Nice set it comes with two pairs of lashes and a mini lash glue and this is what they look like on um, they look really pretty. It's the ones Lola and Ivy. Neither one, though, I feel like are perfect for my eye shape. So I think this one I'll probably be skipping out on. But again, it is 30% off. So it's really tempting to get 30% off on two pairs of House of Lashes when that is one of my favorite lash brands. Then... I put in the Freck Beauty Best of Freck Duo Face Set. It has their little freckle pen thing and then a cheek slime. Um, it looks so nice. Uh, I haven't tried anything from Freck and I am really curious about the brand. But it, $25, I mean, all most of these things are around the same price point and this may or may not actually make it in my cart but I'm definitely interested in it um I saw this one in Bridget's video I didn't even know it was available and I did add it to my loves list because of her the next item on my list is the Tatcha Dewy Cleanse and Hydrate it has a mini of their rice wash and dewy skin cream 
and I've never tried Tatcha skincare. It is really pricey skincare, but I've always heard really good things, especially about the dewy skin cream. So I am really interested in this one. This would be a good affordable introduction to the brand, I feel like. But I'm so backed up on skincare and I have so much I still have to test that I don't know if I can justify that even at 15% off. Next we have the Tower 28 Shine On Iced Latte Lip Jelly Duo. This is $22 at a $28 value for two of their lip jellies. I've heard really good things about these. I've never t tried Tower 28. Um, they look like really cute shades, but I just, I'm not sure. There's so many lip products that I want, and I have so many, it's hard to justify them. Um, and the next item I put on my loves list is the Laneige Dream Team Lip Set. This has a, um, what is it? A glowy balm in berry and a sleepy mask in peach iced tea. And I've always heard rave reviews about both of these products. <sighs> I don't know. I just really want to see if it's worth the hype. But at the same time, it's like I have like a lot of lip masks already. I don't know that I need this, but I want it. I want it. So there's that set. Um, I also threw in the Sephora collection set since Sephora collection is 30% off. Um, this is $18 before the 30%. It has a lip gloss, a liquid lipstick, and a bullet lipstick. And I haven't tried any of these formulas from Sephora Collection. So I thought it would be fun. And ooh, that color does not look good. Um, hopefully I'm lining the video up right. But yeah, that color does, that's not cute. Um, maybe I don't want that one. <laughs> Uh, and then I really, this is one I think for sure, for sure I'm definitely getting if it's still in, top, in stock by the time like the VIB days roll around. This is the Fenty Beauty Resting Peach Face Cream Blush and Mini Gloss Balm Cream Duo. I have never tried either of these type of products from Fenty. I've never tried their gloss bombs. I've never tried their cream blushes and I love the peach tones of these. Like I want this one so bad Ugh! I if it if it goes out of stock I might cry I might cry okay more lip stuff um, the Sephora swipe of color lipstick and lip balm set for 36 okay my camera shut off so let's start screen recording again so that we can be together so this is the Sephora favorites Swipe of Color Lipstick and Lip Balm Set. All of these colors look really nice. Like, that looks so pretty. But, I don't know. It's $36. That's kind of a lot. Um, we'll see. I didn't realize I had so many lip products on my loves list. Oh my gosh. So the next one is more lips. This is the Fenty Beauty Glossy Posse. It has a full size cream and then three mini of the original formula, I think. And they look so pretty, but like if I'm gonna get that other Fenty set, I'll probably skip out on this one because it's $38. Then is another rare beauty set. This is Selena's favorites. It has the mascara, a lip product a highlighter and a blush and the blush is in the shade that I have had on my wish list for a long time the shade joy and I really want to try the mascara because of the way Samantha March raves about it so I am like heavily eyeing this set this set will probably end up in my cart um, with the Fenty set then I have the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Lip Secret Set. As you can see, it has four of her lip products in the Pillow Talk shade. I'm kind of considering this because I really want to try Charlotte Tilbury lip products, and this has a variety of formulas. But at the same time, like, I'm not super sold on this 
shade like the mauvey pillow talk shade i don't know that it's for me so we'll see then i threw in a bottle of dior sauvage elixir my husband loves this scent and it is really pricey but you know the sale so maybe i might get a christmas present for my husband with his favorite scent so then i put in more lips oh gosh Rachel, <laughs> were your lips like thirsty when you did this? Um, it's the Lawless Forget the Filler Lip Plumper Trio and I've heard such good things about these. I'm not super like into the pinky tones of them. So I don't know if this is a set for me, but I'm still like intrigued by them. Um, then there's a Sephora lip plumping sets and this one is $20 for three of them and they look like super cute shades like a light nude a mid-tone nude and then a more darker rosy tone so pretty now we're getting into older individual stuff that I didn't add through like holiday gift sets so I had um put in this lip balm from Sephora collection uh, probably because of the 30% off sale it sold out so probably won't be getting that then I really 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 want this one this is from Violet Voss it is the mini Care Bears eyeshadow palette the colors look so cute the packaging looks so cute I love the Care Bears like it's so nostalgic for me as I'm sure it is for a lot of us and it's only $18 before the sale price so I'm pretty sure this one is going in my cart um and yeah that's pretty much all of the newer stuff I added I did throw in a couple on my loves list mini Natasha Denona palettes the Xenon, I don't know, I have so many of those tones already. The Mini Tropic, because I did kind of take apart the Big Tropic and depot everything. So I'm kind of thinking of getting the Mini Tropic just so I like have a Tropic palette. I don't know, but that that's pretty much everything that I'm considering for the sale again I am not definitely not buying everything that I mentioned but those are the things like I'm keeping an eye on and I'm considering for the sale and that are on my loves list and my wish list so I literally can't with this camera you guys it shut off and overheated again <sighs> anyway let me know if you guys are picking up anything during the sale. I'd love to know what you guys are getting. And also, if there's anything in particular that you think I should get that you recommend, let me know. Please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button if you've not already. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!